Last video I added percussion to our vocal chop. Now I will finish the sequence with the bass line and the groove tool. To add a VST bass line, you just create a normal MIDI track and then this button has an option to insert soft synth. From there, you just scroll your list of synths, load it into Acid, and pick whatever you want. So right now I have inline MIDI editing on, which is located on the toolbar. That's what gives me this piano on the side, and now I can draw notes directly on my timeline for any MIDI clip. Right, but so far the track feels very robotic and that's because every note is hitting the grid with 100% accuracy. So I like to use the groove tool to add a bit more of a human-like element to my work. I'll show you how it works by painting a groove over these hi-hats. I'm going to select the light shuffle groove, which I think is a good starting point for what we're trying to do. The groove tool actually works on MIDI clips as well as loops and samples, so I'll paint it over my MIDI instruments too. sounds more natural but it's a little too swingy I think so what I'm gonna do is open up the groove editor and show you how you can adjust a specific groove to fit your needs exactly. Moving these markers around shows you how the groove stretches the audio it's painted over. So my aim here is just to get a very slight swing that'll give us that relaxed feel. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Acid Pro does have a free trial, so if this looks fun, I encourage you to go check it out. All the drum samples and presets you've heard in these videos were created by me, and you can support me by going to meltomusic.com. Thanks again.